the thing that drives my passion for training is when I'm in the training room and somebody has a light bulb moment. When something that I've said or perhaps an exercise that they've done suddenly opens their eyes to a new and better way to behaving. This not only helps them in their career development, but importantly, it impacts all the people that they are working with as colleagues or leading if they're in a leadership role. So that's my question to you, can you? What can you actually take away from this that tomorrow or next week when you're in your office, in your team, what, what, can you, what, what did you learn from this? I think one of the things that is most unique about me is that I have a very positive, can-do, optimistic attitude. And I try to inspire the people in the room that the best way to move forward is to be solution focused, to find the, the best of the situation that they're in and improve everything with that filter. And you can't have anything propping it up, so there's no, no columns holding up your bridge. Imagine something that is like an arch, like a bridge. Like The next step from that is to think about getting them, how we can get them to commit to making a change and to take what they learn in the training room and implement it back in the workplace. I've attended the core uh, leadership uh, workshop with uh, Cynthia from uh, Visibility and uh, the way she conducted the workshop was excellent. The engagement level was very high from all the participants, the exercises that she used, the examples she gave, kept the energy in the room at a very high level. And I think uh, we have learned a lot from today. Personally, uh, I will go back and reflect on what was discussed in the, in the workshop. It sometimes takes courage for individuals to, to take a different path, particularly if the leadership is not following the same trend. But I really want to convince them that best practice is the best way to do.